you're not alone. The simulated save for The Witcher 2 in The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt confuses a lot of people. I'm going to break it down so there's only one thing that you need to remember to have the best possible playthrough of The Witcher 3 when selecting the choices in The Witcher 2 simulated save shaving scene. You want to watch this video all the way to the end so that you can spare Letho and have him help you fight the wild hunt in The Witcher 3. Subscribe and hit the bell notification icon. We cover tips and tricks for The Witcher 3 game. First thing, when you are at the initial screen, you want to select a new game and then fresh start. You choose your difficulty level. Uh, you can cho choose tutorials on for tips. And then you want to simulate a Witcher 2 save and select on for that. And that's important because that is what's going to allow you to have Letho as one of your brothers in arms against the Wild Hunt. And it also opens up a really cool quest line with Letho. After that, you're going to play in Kaer Morin and White Orchard. And then you're going to be taken to the Vizima Palace after you complete your quest in White Orchard with Yennefer. And then you're going to find yourself in a bath. And this assistant to the Emperor is going to bring you for a shave, which you can't refuse. And then uh, General Voorhees is going to ask you some questions. Now, I've played all through The Witcher 2. And while I recognize all these questions, I've also played all the way through The Witcher 3. And none of them matter except for the Letho question. So you don't really need to worry about the Lavalettes. It's not going to make a difference. You don't need to worry about the question to she about Sheila de Tanterville. I'm not going to bore you with explaining who she is. Answer it any way you want. Answer the Lavalette question any way you want. Answer the question about Yorvath, the elf, or any way you want. You won't see Yorvath in The Witcher 3. You might see, you will see Roach, but Roach won't mind if you went down Yorvath's path. Likewise, if you say you didn't save Triss, Triss will not mind that you didn't save her. So it doesn't matter what you answer to that question either. You won't see the other two people that you saved instead of Triss. So I guess maybe you want to save Triss. Doesn't matter. They ask you if you saved the sorceress Sheila de Tanserville from the Megascope. Doesn't matter if you did. She'll either be dead already or you'll see her die in prison later on. It's probably more merciful to let her die in Witcher 2. And then the last question you're going to get is about Letho of Gullet. And you want to choose choice two that you did not kill him. That alliance still alive, question mark, what happened to Letho? And that's it. The shave scene will end and you've made your choices from The Witcher 2 so that your Witcher 3 will be consistent with The Witcher 2, which you may or may not have played. So PC players can import their saves directly, but uh, Xbox players need to use the simulated save, and that's why they created the simulated save. But if you never played The Witcher 2, then you can use the simulated save and change your experience in The Witcher 3 relative to the baseline where Letho is dead. All right, since you've said that Letho is alive in the shave scene, you will find him in Reardon Manor. So you can uh, pick up the contract to Reardon Manor in Velen, or go to Reardon Manor, and you will find the traps that Letho has set out, and you will find Letho, and he'll take you on his own path. And at the end of his own quest line, it's going to look like he's dead. You're going to find he's not dead, and that's going to allow you to recruit him to fight the Wild Hunt at Kaer Morin. And he's a big help, and he's a lot of fun. Let's listen to the scene at the end of Witcher 2 where Geralt spares Letho. And after that, we'll listen to the shave scene in The Witcher 3 where Geralt tells Morhan Voorhees, the Nilfgaardian general, that he spared Letho. He believes he alone knows what is good and what is evil, and that this gives him the right to dispense justice. Your comrade Letho of Gullet described you so. Quite accurate, I'd say. 
My comrade, your agent. Well, national interest calls on one to forge difficult alliances at times. Alliances with witches included. At an ongoing alliance? What's Letho up to? I had hoped you would answer that question. Ah, so Letho's hiding from you. Must have a good reason. Was there a shift in national interest that might have caused that? I don't know where he is. Wouldn't tell you if I did anyway. Blade or no blade to my throat. I believe that is all. Force me to fight, and this time I'll kill you. I've learned all I wanted to know. I can feel the memories coming back. Your death won't change a thing. Go where you will. Just like that. No threats. No words of wisdom. Are you going or not? Farewell, Geralt. Subscribe. We need more subscribers. And check out some of our other videos, like our tips for starting an NG Plus playthrough. Good luck on the path. I'm Linus Wilson.